I created my very own club in FIFA, and within two seasons, we're on the verge of getting promoted to the championship. To make things even more insane, we've also made it to the FA Cup semi-finals. Now, the road to getting here was not easy. We had to knock out teams like Spurs. Shipping this one in. Oh, what a hit now. Ibsen Rossi in the 81st minute. It's done. His first ever goal for S2GFC, and he's just sent us to the next round of the FA Cup. Spurs are out. We also had to get through Manchester. Manchester City. And they're looking for Max Holmes. This could be something special here. Max Holmes, he's got the chance. And Max Holmes has done it in the 80th minute. What is going on right now in the FA Cup? We could be through to the semi-finals. And now here we are in an FA Cup semi-final and so close to getting automatic promotion or even winning the title and going to the championship. The season finale of our Creator Club series is going to be absolutely incredible. If you guys believe we can win the FA Cup, then I need y'all to subscribe to the channel. When the boss speaks, you listen absolutely right. Official s 2 and his army are into the FA Cup semi-finals. I still don't know how we pull this off, bro. Look at this image. Iconic. Pep Guardiola getting a footballing lesson from the mastermind that is myself. What a freaking insane game that was as well. Okay, what's this? s 2 GFC in an FA Cup final. I will not be there. Bro, we've got Fulham. Guys, we've knocked out teams like City and Spurs. Surely we can get through Fulham, but you know what? Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Don't you forget, we're a, we're a Division 3 club. We're playing in League 1. We're about to cause the upset of a lifetime in the FA Cup if things can go our way. Let's see. The good news is McGinty is back from all his issues and we can now have him as a starter in our team. And the team is looking really good, boys. Can this team, though, go all the way in an FA Cup? Oh my god, the thought of it is just crazy. And of course, don't forget, we're in a battle for the title as well. Do you know what, guys? Let's not waste any more time. It's time for the FA Cup semi-finals, our first ever trip to Wembley, and I really don't think I'm making any changes to the team. This is how I want to start the game. These are the heroes that got us here. And let's get the job done and make it to our very first final. How insane would that be? I don't think we've ever played in a stadium as big as this. s 2 GFC at Wembley. Things you do love to see. Let's do this, boys. The likes of Max Holmes getting such a big platform to perform. We're at the Wembley Stadium, but we're not here just to admire the stadium. We're here to win. Oh, Chiellini. I I'm sure a player like him being in our team is going to be absolutely massive because in cup semi-finals, you need experience and he's got plenty of it. As we're now on the attack with Paulinho. What a signing he's been. Looking for Max Holmes. Maybe a shot from distance nope. and station. What a save, Leno. Corner. I would love a goal from a set piece, but it's never easy. Never is easy. We've got a chance here with Paulinho. Oh, gets taken out. Ref. Ref. Tyler's holding up his man really well. Looking for Derek Burns. Another time. No, this time he misses. Derek Burns has made a habit of scoring in the FA Cup for us. But this time he puts it wide. What a chance. Derek Burns. Looking really good. Another finesse shot. This time goes with his right foot, bro. Him and his long shots. We've seen what he can do. And I'm trying to get him into those situations again and again. Because we know how good he can be. Go on, Derek Burns. Go on. Oh, what a ball for Maxi. Holmes, please. No. Why use your left foot, you idiot? Use your right foot, man. Oh, I'm fuming on the touchline as well after seeing that. No, I'm not liking this. I'm really Thank not you. liking this Ibsen. Rossi doing a great job defensively. I got to say, we've been spot on. Oh, look at that space here for Paulinho. Go on. Go on. Show me your Brazilian flair. We need to see a bit of Jogo Bonito. Oh, come on. What do we need to do to score in this game? I'm getting really nervous now. No, this is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Oh, we concede. Is our FA Cup journey going to come to an end right here? To Fulham? Oh, no. We, we can't give up. We can't give up. Paulinho. I see Tyler. And straight away, we've got a chance. Tyler can't get the shot off. Max Holmes. I see Tyler. He's kept himself on side. And David Tyler. It's always him. We're back in the FA Cup. Tyler has now scored one of the club's most important goals. We're in the fight. We're not out yet. Paulinho looking for Max Holmes. And straight away, we're making a comeback. Max Holmes. Easy. Bro, that was the worst chip shot I think I've ever seen. Here's Max Holmes. Done really well. Left foot. Oh, he scored. Max Holmes scoring the goal. That could send us to an FA Cup final. That is the spirit of S2 GFC. We do not give up we do not fall and if we do we get back up we've made it 2-1 boys max holmes fighting for every inch there and then of course the finish come on boys 
we're in the lead. You know what? Now they're pushing forward so much. Our job is to just keep the ball, but it's tough, man. It's tough. They're a Premier League team with quality players everywhere. It's going to be a challenge, but we need to survive here. No, this is bad. I do not want to be conceding this late on. It's a nope. brilliant ball in. What a save from McGinty. That was insane. How did he prevent that from going in? Guys, we always talk about great goals that win new games, but this is a save that has just kept us alive in the FA Cup. Simply sensational. Oh my God, they've got their goalkeeper forward as well. We do not want to be conceding from him. Get the ball away, guys, which we have done. Tyler gets taken out. That's perfectly fine. Just 30 seconds. It's almost done. Blow the whistle, ref. It's done. We're going to be coming to Wembley again, but this time it's going to be for the FA FA Cup final. The journey continues. Our insane cup run continues. We're gonna be in an FA Cup final. And so this is how it is. We now have to get past Manchester United to win the FA Cup. This is our ultimate challenge. And if we do this, we'll not only be winning a trophy so quickly, we'll also be in the Europa League for the following season. This is gonna be the biggest game we've ever experienced. But before that, our job is to secure promotion to the Champions Championship. To be honest, that is probably more important. And with other teams having already played their games, it's it's looking a bit tricky. We need to start winning all our games. Also, guys, we've got massive news. I think everybody's been watching the FA Cup, and that's why now brands are approaching us. We might be able to move on from S2G.shop. Take a look at this. S2G FC is in talks with KSI and Logan Paul for a potential shirt sponsorship with Prime Energy for the following season. The deal could be worth three million pounds. Oh my god, that is such good money. We only got a million from S2G.shop. We'll be getting Prime on our shirts for the next season, but the deal is contingent on the fact that we get promoted. I think we're going to sign the deal and take Prime as our sponsor for next season because I think it's a great brand, and the, the first thing we need to do is just get promotion. We go from Wembley to playing at the Javier Presa Arena. Well, to be fair, the Javier Presa Arena is clear. Paulinho looking for Max Holmes. It's a good ball, and Max Holmes has taken a really good touch, and he's got the power to finish it. Brilliant goal from Max Holmes. We lead 1-0. Barry looking for Raul Lopez, who's found a bit of space and strikes it well. That would have been a nice goal to see. No, no, no. This is not what we need. We can see the penalty. It's Sully Montari taking it. Can McGinty save it? No. Easy. That's one complaint I have at Woman McGinty. He just doesn't get it right for pens. The way things are, we literally cannot afford to lose. We need to win this game. Max Holmes looking out wide for Paulinho. The Brazilian, oh, he messes up. And no, we've dropped points. This is bad. This is really bad. I don't think we can win at the championship now. Peterborough have already won the league by the looks of it. We've got two games and this is getting really bad. We need to win both to get automatic promotion. Otherwise, we're going to literally have to go through playoffs. Offs, which is something I don't want to endure. I really don't. Our next game's against Wickham, and we need to win this game as Dara Burns completely threw on goal. He's going to set it up for Tyler, and that's a simple goal. Sometimes you just got to take the simple chances. We need to win this game. Don't concede something silly in this game. Gillini's backing off, doing a good job, but these guys are really good. We do not want to concede here. Good stuff, Raul Lopez. Lopez. Looking for Berry, waiting for that pass for Tyler, but it's an awful pass. Tyler still keeps it in. Dara Burns, shimmy inside, looking for Raul Lopez. Sees now, chance for Paulinho. Straight at the keeper. Not again, guys. Not again. Another penalty. And this time, McGinty saves it. We needed him to save it. Finally, he's getting the pens right. That penalty save was huge because now we're on the attack here. It's Paulinho, the Brazilian. What? How did he miss that simple chance? What are we doing here? Barry has the ball. No, no, it's Dara Burns who misses. We still might have the chance here. No, we don't. We're bottling it. I need you, Max Holmes. I've never needed you more in my life. There you go, Max Holmes. We need you to score this, please. And of course he does. That is a rocking finish. 2-0, and that should settle things. And we actually end up scoring a couple more and winning this game 4-0. And that 4-0 actually helps us out massively because look at our goal difference. It's up to 29, one less than Barnsley. So I think if we win our game and outscore Barnsley, we should finish second. It's a crazy scenario to be in. The good thing for us is Barnsley play Ipswich, who are fourth in the league, so they also have quite a bit to play for. So this is getting really interesting. All we gotta do is win our game and score a ton of goals. Before we get into one of the most important games in our club's history, time for a quick press conference. Okay, so we're seeing some more Berry slander. I think you should have never given the captaincy to Berry because he's levels behind the others in the team. When you keep improving the team, you'll always have a hole in it with Berry. and I thought Holmes would be a better captain. Okay, so basically, 
Berry. Berry slander. I see that a lot in the comments. You guys, I don't know why you guys aren't, aren't happy with Berry, but I genuinely think he's been good. We can't be completely judging everything based on overalls. Plus, I'm sure next season, Callum Berry's dynamic potential is going to unlock and he's going to keep getting better. So you know what? I want to keep trusting Berry. I feel like I want to make him an icon here at S2GFC and that's clearly how I want to do things. But I do acknowledge what you guys are saying. If next season we can't get Callum Berry to like a 74-75 overall, I think it'll be time to look for someone else potentially once we get into the Premier League or use Joe Bellingham more. Okay, we're already talking about player of the season. I think there's nobody else than McGinty who deserves the player of the season. He saved S2GFC so many times. I think, yeah, in the attack, we've had moments where Max Holmes is delivered, Tyler's delivered, Dara Burns is delivered, but one constant in this team has been McGinty. That man has always delivered for us, so I would agree with you. If we were doing our player of the season now, it would be him. This is it, guys. One of our most important games ever. EFL League One game to decide whether we'll make it to the championship or not. We need to not just win this game but win it big as well. This could be our final game in this league and boy, do I want to get promoted to the championship. So let's do it. Can I just say Chiellini has been an absolute rock for us and oh, what a ball that is to see David Tyler. Perfect pass. There goes Tyler looking for a ball in and Max Holmes heads it home. That's the first goal of the night. We need to win this big and so far we've started perfectly. Chiellini, you deserve a ton of credit. I don't know if it's going to be his final season for the club, but that is a game-defining moment that he's produced. We need to get as many goals as possible here because I do not know what's going to happen with the Barnsley game. Paulinho trying something. Ooh, hoo, hoo. I want to see a bit of that from Paulinho. Come on. Oh, good stuff from Dara Burns here showing his energy. And now it's Max Holmes looking back for Paulinho, getting it back for himself. Max Holmes off the post. Oh, that is frustrating, but we still have it. No, we don't. Oh, we do. Dara Burns could whip in across. He is doing so. Tyler can't win the header. We need to keep pushing and scoring here. We might get that chance. Raul Lopez puts it above the bar. One thing I haven't seen from Raul Lopez is gold. So hopefully soon he'll add that to his locker. Here we go with Paulinho. Looking inside for Holmesy and a fantastic finish. How did he squeeze that in? I have no idea. But the way things are going, we're on the verge of securing promotion. The thing is, I have no idea how the Ipswich Barnsley game is going on. But we're doing our job just fine. Paulinho picking up an assist. What a finish from Max Holmes. I think 4-0 will be the scoreline where we can be like, yeah, we, we, we should be able to get promotion automatically. And so let's push for that 4-0. Here's Dara Burns going on a run all by himself. Oh, Dara Burns. That might be the best one he scored. And he scored a ton of screamer in the first half itself we've absolutely dismantled our opponents and that might be the best goal yet. Dara Burns with a screamer. He's growing into this team so much. What a signing man. Honestly, look at him go beating players for fun and then a rocket into the top right corner. That is just brilliant. Half time and so far we've done our job of winning this game. I don't think we're going to lose here but it's the goal difference that I'm really worried about. So can we see? Oh, we can't see the score lines of the other game so we're just going to have to maybe score one more goal. Lopez looking inside for Tyler as he sees Max Holmes. Oh, he takes that into his stride so well. It's 4-0 in a game where we needed to score a ton of goals. The team was up for the challenge and ready to go. And there you go. It's 4-0. I won't lie. In a couple of days, we've got an FA Cup final as well. So I am going to make some changes to rest a few players. We'll bring on Jimenez. We'll bring on Job Bellingham for Raul Lopez. And I'll also bring on Sam Smith for Tyler. Been a while since we've used the Spanish Messi. In the absence of Dara Burns, he was absolutely brilliant. And he's just getting better and better as time goes. Berry. Bellingham. Now it is Callum Berry. Oh, the goal I wanted to see. You guys keep criticizing him. And our captain steps up instead and ends up scoring. This is emotional. The goal that could potentially send us to the championship. This has been one of our best performances when the team needed it the most. Wait a minute, guys. I'm confused. Barnsley haven't played their game yet for some weird reason. We've completed all 46 of our games. Why? Why is this happening? Ipswich as well have two games in hand. I'm so freaking confused. I guess we're 
gonna have to wait to find out whether we've secured promotion or not, although the season is done. I don't like this, guys. We're going into the FA Cup final without knowing whether we've done enough in the league or not, but oh well. We're gonna have to put that out of our mindset right now and focus on one of the club's most important games ever. A chance for these players, players who were non-league level a few seasons ago, to now be playing in an FA Cup final. This is it. Oh my god, we're playing for that trophy. We're playing for the FA Cup. This is it. We're back at Wembley. Do you know what? We need to have a bit of confidence. We knocked out City. We knocked out Spurs. We knocked out Fulham. We can do this. We've got to believe we can do this. Oh, but we're up against the likes of Casemiro to here. And that is the trophy we're playing for. The first ever trophy for S2GFC. I'm so glad that we've got Giorgio Chiellini. But this is the route that we had to take to get here. And it was tough. It was really tough. But here we are. And let's do this. Manchester United already looking ruthless, man. As we had to commit a foul there, but they don't give it. One Bissaka looking nope. inside. What a chance. McGinty to make the save. And we just about cleared the ball away. United attacking us with everything they've got. I'm not liking this. Oh, they almost just scored within seven minutes minutes if this is how the FA Cup final is going to be I'm I'm scared as I said we need the experience of Chiellini in a cup final this could be the final trophy he wins and what an achievement it would be to win with S2 GFC don't forget a lot of players that we have Barry Max Holmes they've all been at the Man United Academy this is a chance at revenge for them but because of how good United are Oh no, we've just been opened up. We got so lucky there. United keep coming at us, man. I don't like this. Get the ball away. Ooh, 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 it's getting scary now. Oh, Gerard Moreno has broken through. Still Gerard Moreno looking for a pass inside McGinty again. So far, it's been all McGinty saving us. Play the ball away, boys. Right now, it's all about just surviving because we just can't seem to get into rhythm. Look at them play. This is getting a bit out of hand now. It's, it's all Manchester United. They're opening nope. us up. McGinty again with the save. Ah, there's Eric Denhog. We're up against a really good coach here. Anthony, this is bad. I'm sliding in. No point. It's McGinty who's saving us again and again. This man's a legend. Oh my god, that's a bad one from Berry. It's frustration. We've barely been able to get the ball. Now they've got themselves a set-piece routine. What are they going to do? Lisandro Martinez, Anthony looking inside. They're opening us up. We're blocking shot, uh, shooting lanes. Sancho looking inside. Patterson does well, but we're just surviving. Finally, though, we've got a chance at on the counter attack. It's Dara Burns, the man who's been carrying us in this FA Cup. Ah, oh, the Ronaldo chop isn't going to work against Varane. He knows the Ronaldo chop too well. Half time and look at this. Our XG is zero. We're literally McGinn DFC right now. No, no, no. Not so early in the half. And now we're going to be on the back foot. Even McGinty couldn't stop that. We concede in this FA Cup final. Aye, aye, aye. Okay, but we don't give up, guys. We didn't give up against City. We didn't give up against Spurs. We've got to believe that we can compete. We might need another Dara Burn special. Yeah, he goes for it. Oh, this time it's above the crossbar. And the pressure of the final. He couldn't get it right. No, they might score again. We cannot let them score again. Oh, my God. Sancho just misses. Raul Lopez. Cleverly done to find David Tyler. What a chance. Oh, it's straight to David De Gea. Normally, Tyler would find the back of the net from there. Man United just easing into this game now. Playing the correct passes. Ah, but, but we're defending well now. We're not giving them that space. Go on, Patterson. We need a bit of a really bursting run from you there. But Rafa Varane. Being up against a multiple time Champions League winner. It ain't easy. Sancho looking inside for Moreno. It's a clever pass inside. They've made a huge blunder there. That should have been 2-0. And on the breakaway we go. Max Holmes controlling that well. There goes Max Holmes bringing it inside. But Rafa Varane, just stop it, man. I can't compete against him. Right now, oh, Varane is just too good. Okay, what just happened there? It's a blunder. As Tyler goes sliding in. No, they made a huge mistake and we couldn't capitalize. I think it's over, guys. I really think it's over. Oh, I think it's over. I just committed a stupid foul as well, but no. No, referee. Sancho goes for goal. He almost scores, but that's it. I think that's it. We've lost the FA Cup final. Oh my god. That's... That's harsh. This hurts. This really hurts. The effort we put to get here and now to end up losing our first cup final. The first taste of defeat like this. So close. 
but yet so far. But you know what? We've got to take the positives from this. For a third division club to reach the FA Cup final, we've won the hearts of everyone and we will be back here soon. Our season could absolutely crumble if we don't end up making promotion. So let's see what's happened. Do we have to endure the playoffs and everything? No, we don't. I think we have secured promotion. We still have a few games left to be played. Let's get through them as well just to confirm whether we've made promotion or not. Yep. Okay, the league is now complete and this is the final day. Barnsley actually ended up losing their game, which means we do end up securing automatic promotion. Kind of a shame we couldn't win the league, but hey, you can't have it all. We had an incredible cup run. We now get promoted as well to the championship, and I cannot wait to continue the journey of S2GFC. This season, Max Holmes was sensational. He's now 30, but he's done such an incredible job, and let's hope he can keep this up. He went up by six ratings this season. David Tyler went up by nine ratings. How did that that happened. What a player. Dara Burns as well enjoying a great season. Paulinho, what a phenomenal signing. Captain Berry did his job. It was an amazing season all round. Next season with Prime coming in, maybe new kits and everything, new transfers, a new league. The journey will continue and I'll catch you guys for the next one.